guys, it's Kat. Today is the day that I know a lot of you guys have been waiting for. I am doing my deep cleaning routine. This is something I'll do every two to three months. Just get a really deep clean and make sure that all of the nooks and crannies, I hate that saying, I don't know why I just said that, all the little sections in my room are clean. If you are new here, I'd love to have you as a subscriber. I do a lot of cleaning and organization, cleaning and organization videos as well as I'm getting into doing fitness videos. So a lot of in the gym fitness videos and at home workouts. So if you guys are interested in seeing those, I'll also have my health and fitness playlist link down below. Let me know in the comments if you're new here. And also if you are a subscriber, I'd love to know how long you've been a subscriber. I think that's so cool to see. So if you're new here, let me know in the comments. And if you're not new, then let me know how long you've been here. And I think that's all that I have to say for this intro. So let's just get into my deep cleaning routine. First, I recommend you get into some comfy clothes or like preferably gym clothes or something that you don't mind getting a tad sweaty in just in case. And then the first thing I will do is remove all of the sheets from my bed. I'm talking bed sheets, duvet covers, pillowcases, all of that stuff. Take it off, throw it in the washing machine. And here I had to do two washes because I couldn't fit everything, but I'm doing that. And then while I'm cleaning my room, I just made my bed as best I could with the blanket that I had. So next it's time to deal with the clothes all around my room. Now when I'm doing my deep cleaning routine, I actually have a closet clean out routine that I do once a month as well. And I made a whole video on that, a video on that. So I'll have that link below, but I just go through all the clothes that I want to keep and take out clothes that I want to give away or throw away, whatever the case may be, and make sure my closet's nice and clean. Once my clothes are taken care of, I will take a garbage bag or garbage can and go around my room and just pick up any garbage that's lying around. Today I didn't have too much, but I'm taking all the garbage that I do have. Here I'm putting anything that's not in its place back in its place. And if there's anything that doesn't have a home, I'll decide if I wanna keep it or get rid of it. All right, now is my favorite part. I am grabbing a duster and a cleaning spray and just dusting off my windows, walls, all that trim everything the tables and then i'm completely clearing off my desk and using my mrs myers multi-surface meaning cleaning spray which i've talked about many times before and i'm obsessed with it so i do that and then put everything back on my desk and then i will go around and clean all of the mirrors in my room all of my windows any surface and then something that a lot of people often forget to clean which i did for a while and i realized how messy it was was my computer so i just cleaned off my computer screen as well and then it was time to grab a vacuum and vacuum up my room. When I'm doing my deep cleaning routine, I really like to try and get under my bed, under my dresser, anything that will accumulate a lot of dust bunnies. And then I'm just mopping up my floor so they stay nice and shiny. So by this point, my sheets are clean, so I'll go grab them from the dryer and put them back on my bed. And it is such a great feeling to make my bed when the rest of my room is clean. And then everything just looks like it's all put together and it all came together very nice, in my opinion. Hi again, guys. If you haven't seen my Habits for a Clean Room or my weekly cleaning routine, I'll have both of those linked down below. That's about it for this video. I love you guys so, so much. Thank you so, so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye. That's my girl.